song is so funny. I don't know why I don't see. I don't know. I should be serious about this, but. There's something very odd about this hallway. I'm giving off a strange vibe to- ah, Get away from me! I know what you're probably wondering at this point. Is Silent evil? Oh yeah. What was the whole thing about anyways? You know, when Ixo was screaming like a banish. Why are you all looking at me? I don't know what's going on. Any more. Even if the Saw Savior happens to be another constructor of your narrative, they've proven to be a hero that we can depend on. Ooh. The Saw Savior has fought through both thick and thin to prove themselves as someone who we can trust in a bitter end. Indeed, even we have nothing else to do. We have you, Noble Saw Savior. Thank you very much for mentioning me. I was kind of like really confused if you were going to mention me because you guys have been ignoring me when we had your conversation with Silent. You are our true light in the dark. I am grateful for everything that you have done so far. You are your defense and what you certainly must pay for his crimes and also loves to move on. We need you. Looks like it's your turn to save our world and a bunch of other dimensions too. You, I guess, you can do it. You're our last chance. I believe in you. All of us do. I still don't quite understand what's going on, but if anyone can save the world in a time of need, it's you. We're counting on you. This is it, not our last hope. And, but don't let that imitate, intimidate you. There's a 100% chance on you. You are the new star savior. We are putting our faith into your abilities. Huh? Thank you, guys. I see. Then I must first destroy. Bleh. Then I must first destroy the very source of your hope. Farewell, star savior. Oh. Please stand by. Now I shall go to the boss place. But what about Celestial? Yep. I knew this is happening. From the very beginning I was talking about. I knew that he's the enemy. Uh oh. Oh! Hey! Oh no, the shards. Okay, well I have to take my- I'm gonna- Yeah. Ah! What is it going on? Nice wings, dude, by the way. Who oh, knows? I wanna know his true- Oh god! Psh! He's like, psh! That he was not kid. No, please. Stop. 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 Oh my god. Oh no. Oh no. He's stabbed. Oh no, oh no. Oh no, he's too fast for me. But I know he's gonna go to true form like all the other bosses like Compale, Ulips, and Ixel, they're all gonna go to the true form. But I don't have enough health for true form though. Come on, show me your true form. Buddy, please show me your true form. I am waiting. Oh no. Stratosphere! What are you? Okay. You have nothing to say? Uh, uh, huh? I'm, I'm free. After all this time? Were you the one who saved me? I cannot thank you enough. Sorry, I haven't introduced myself yet. Is your name Celestial? You're the sauce. I'm done. I'm so. <laughs> I knew at the secret ending of the first game, it would say the big X at the secret that they say you are so you are stratosphere. You and stratosphere are both adventurous, and you're the same person. Oh my god, that plot twist! Oh god, I can't handle that. I have, I'm so speechless. Huh? Whoa. 
Get back! It's the Radosphere! Looks like Stratosphere was really around here. A lot of us assist this one. Wait a moment! I'm not sure the Stratosphere's are enemy here. Let's see them out. Oh no. And it's just like, I'm so so sorry. What are you talking about? I don't believe that we've actually met before. Well, of course, you wouldn't remember anything. Your memory was right, and it's all my fault. Oh, This is so sad, actually. Yeah, no, Cylon wiped our memories, not you. Unless Stratosphere was really the one who wiped our memories, don't let them get away! Would you all just stop for a second? Listen to what they're trying to say! Well, for starters, I am the star savior. Well, I guess I was the first star savior, seeing that there's now a second one. And you expect us to believe that? Well, yes. When you... when you put it like that, it's a little hard to believe. That's not the craziest part, though. Everyone knows how the Star Savior defeated Stratosphere, but nobody knew that the Star Savior was transformed into Stratosphere and sent back to time. They sent back, ugh, sent back in time to fight themselves. Wait, so the Stratosphere I fought in the first game because, of course, I didn't play the first game before playing this one, and I completed it. The Star, the Stratosphere defeated. It's supposed to be a future version of myself, so I was going back in time to fight myself? This doesn't make sense, I'm so confused. If you guys know the theory, just comment down below. It would really help me. This would this would ultimately be my faith. My transformation into Stratosphere was, no, was by no means a doing instantly. Instantaneous. I spent many years knowing I would one day become my own enemy. It was heavenly for the character. So, if I defeated, like, I defeated Stratosphere, like, in the first game, then I suddenly become Stratosphere. This is creepy. I'm, I'm so scared. <laughs> one day, I was no longer able to keep a secret. I decided to tell my closet, most dearest friend, about it. But knowing that their cover has been blown, Silent appeared suddenly and turned my best friend into a point. And who's my best friend? As I was trying, I'm so sorry, I couldn't keep my mouth shut. And now, you don't remember anything. Dot dot dot. Oh my gosh, you really are the Star Savior! Einstein's body temperature has really just to a significant margin. It seems that Anne Sunshine's vocabulary is not large enough to include words, which might describe his current emotional state. I... I... I don't know what to say. I'm at loss for words. Call it. Call it. I don't know. I can't really be mad at you. Because I don't remember anything of that happening, but if it what you say is true. No. I'm sure that I wouldn't be able to keep a secret like that either. Trying to reach out to others was the right thing to do, even if I had unprecedented consequences. Remember, Silent is the real enemy here. None of us deserve any of this. But there's still something I don't quite understand. But how long have you been Stratosphere? And how were you able to how were you able to be free just now? I've been trapped in this world for over three hundred years. Silent has been controlling me like a puppet this entire time. So he's been used, whoa. You see, since I was nothing more than a puppet, Silent has no need to wipe my memories, but thanks to the efforts of the second star savior, Silent lost control, allowing me to break free. Since my memories were still in effect, I was able to shatter my symbol. Would there be any way for the rest of us to shatter our symbols too? I highly doubt it. The symbol can be only shattered if a point regains all of your memories, but all of your memories have been completely rewiped. I still don't understand. Why did Silent wipe our memories in the first place? They said that we had to they have we have once gotten the way. I have no idea, but if we, I were to guess, I'd say the rest of you probably got dangerously close to discovering one of Silent's many secrets. But Silent had kept wipe our memories twice, right? Now that we've been discovering their secrets, Silent has no choice but to use force against us. Yeah, and now that you back Silent to a corner, there's no way that they could be defeated that easily. Make no mistake, the worst has yet to come. Oh dear god. Um, we've been caught. <gasps> it's just true for him! Looks like... Look who finally decided to show their face. 
death? This is like some kind of trap. What? Wait, what are they holding in their hand? This is the shooting star, the very weapon the, se the second star savior just used against me. I managed to snag it from the at the end of our battle. Your most powerful weapon has just been turned against you. You sneaky little... I can't say the bad word in this video. You sneaky little jerk. Glad to see that you two were able to snag something from me, my puppet. You have a lot of nerve to call me that, even after I've been freed. No, you have a lot of nerve to defy me. I am the one who has per perpetuated your existence. You don't mean to say you're a whole creator? Not quite. I'm not sure who allowed you to exist in the first place. I would consider myself a creator, but not the original one. I merely stepped into, I merely stepped in and assumed control. I still don't understand. What was your motive behind the whole thing? Why would you just assume the role of our creator? When I first came to the plane of reality, I was greatly interested in the power of harnesses by the stars. I set up a relatively simple battle between the first star savior and stratosphere in order to motivate them to collect stars. Little did they, they anyone know that the star savior and stratosphere were one and the same. That's what they said in the secret ending. So wait, what? This was the beginning of my glorious narrative. To create such easily believed stories of adventure hope and to reap all of our benefits. I had never seen anything like it before. I suppose you could say I became distracted by the narrative. So I've taken away your shooting star. I no longer care much for the power of the stars. I was much more interested in the narrative. I got crap. He's my second star savior. You used me! What the heck? So you just sent the second star savior on the scratch for nothing? The stars never actually matter? <laughs> Not quite. It's a little more complicated than that. Ugh, nothing makes more sense anymore. Why does this have to be so complex? It is because I am an artist and you are my creations. Huh? Your original forms, they will not be seeing enough for me. I care about yeah, I care about you all so much so so much. I decided to give you new and more pure forms, the bean forms. Every single why don't you just blend in your own way? You found my secrets without much difficulty. This is why I accept you. You were the ones who were perfect enough to become the characters of my narrative. You really don't know how much I care about you all. It makes me happy seeing you all here together, fighting for a single cause. All because I have become your enemy. It warms my heart. That's it guys, Silo has completely lost it. One and one, we're trapped in crazy town now. Silo's emotions are sincere, yet they are, are not logically so. It would be best not to reason with him now. Okay, I got it now. So the secret ending, the huge star that was talking, the one with the question mark, the mysterious stuff. The mysterious stuff was Silo. Well, oh my god, I could, I should have known this. Like, oh my god, I, I'm so sorry, guys. Uh, the big X was Silo. I'm so done right now. I am so, so done. You see, my goal was no longer about hunting the power of the stars. I just wanted to see if you were all able to find the truth. I really wanted to see my friends succeed. We are not your friends! We're here to finally make you pay for your crimes. You don't seem to understand the position you're in right now. I know who my friends are. They're the ones you killed up, and believe me, there is no forgiveness in my heart. Hold on a second, Silent. Are you suggesting that you're willing to die just to see us win in this end? I am not afraid of death. My impact on reality is so great that it wouldn't matter if I died. My narrative would perhaps be finished, but my characters would still live on. But be warned, my control of the universe is so great that... Excuse me. It's so great that, that even reality tends to work in my favor. My hope in all of you does not guarantee your success. Even, especially now that I have worked the shootings after shooting star. Okay, which are you even on? Are you for us or against us? It seems that definitely on the mental side. Now, are you ready to witness my true form? My my, it's been quite a long time since I used it. Well, first of all, please give me back my shooting star. It would be really nice of you. You don't mean that form? 
Well, stratosphere, don't you remember? Well, stratosphere, do you remember? Even after, after 300 years, the red X. Wait, is this stratos? Isn't not stratosphere a symbol? Yes, this was a symbol I gave stratosphere, but it was once my symbol too. The very first symbol I created. I eventually changed my own symbol to the 6.7 symbol you frequently saw me with, but of course, it never beat the classics. If we were to combine those two, we might get Celestial symbol, don't you think? Wait, what? Celestial, isn't that just something you made up to get the second star series to collect stories? Celestial was a made up being? Oh my god, I think it's storming outside, I'm so scared. Oh no, 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 Celestial is quite real, I assure you. So, you're Celestial? Well then. Bring them out here, we'll beat them, no problem. Poor Olive, so misguided in your ways, always jumping to conclusions. But what did you just say about me? Stay back, something is about to happen! The answer is quite simple, as always. Will you see? Are you Celestial? <gasps> yes! <laughs> I am so sorry for laughing, I know I shouldn't laugh, but can we please take the time and just appreciate the plot twist. And I knew this was gonna happen, and it was my first time, oh my goodness. That was an amazing plot twist, good job you guys, good job this little one, you really killed it. And I am the final obstacle, obstacle you must overcome. Please stand by.